<sighs> Welcome guys, this is Stitch. We are back up for another episode of Metro. Let's continue. Yeah. Are you fucking kidding me? Me? A traitor? You tell me, where are you taking that train, huh? On the simple joyride? No, I'm the only one after you've been fought and you're running back to your master. So the verdict has already been passed. We won't even see a trial. Cut that shit out. What do you carry, man? Defense plan? If you want to buy yourself a seaside retirement with a life, you damn cripple? Class? Treason? We have served you people without question for years. We have spilled our blood for the cause. You sold out. They destroyed us and you? I have been a soldier my whole life. I have dedicated my life to my people, my country. I'll be damned if I give it to parasites like you. Let's try that again. Well, it's an interesting story. So this whole time in the first one and the second one. <laughs> oh, satisfying. an idiot being under someone else's leash. We stopped a hundred clicks from Moscow to check our Geiger counters. The thing is, they are all in the green. As if they're in a conspiracy. 
Still, this amazing piece of news doesn't really impress anyone that much. The guys are all confused as to what to do next. And I... I'm just waiting for answers. And hoping the commander, whom until recently I trusted implicitly, is going to be extremely persuasive in his reasoning. Oh, yeah. Let's see what he has for excuses. Why the wrong faces? We are at a crossroads, so to speak, where everybody can help but wonder. What next? Where do we go from here? Hmm, yes. More or less what I expected from you. But you got the picture. So, is your counter functioning? Have you checked it? Yes, it's all green. Double checked it. Stefan's in the green too. We don't need masks here. So, they were telling the truth. Who was telling the truth? Why won't you answer? Who are those people trying to kill us? Why would they shoot at you, the Order's commander? Explain something, at least! You owe us that! Well, I might as well drop the bomb now. The war did not end. What do you uh, mean, what? did not end? Let me finish. Most of our cities are destroyed. The rest of the country is probably under enemy occupation. To avoid new nuclear attacks against us, command chose the only viable course of action. To play dead. To ensure radio silence, the shield system was created. A network of radio jammers covering Moscow and suburbs. So that some radio enthusiasts wouldn't bring more bombs down on our heads by whining on air. And it's one of these jammers that got disabled by the hands of those present here. Could you not have shared that before? Say, before Artyom took that radio outside and caught all that radiation? No! I only got briefed half year ago under a strict you talk, you die policy. And then had to tell my people we were securing a weather station. Sir, with all due respect, if we can't go back, maybe we should advance and move on? I have an idea, but... Uh... Artyom, rather than carrying on with this silent disapproval of yours, check the airwaves. We should be out of the jamming range by now, so give it your best try. Look for transmissions from the Ark. <sighs> Do you understand now why we are traitors in the eyes of command? We shot down a jamming station, shot off the guards, destroyed a patrol train, and ran away from Moscow. Who even needs a trial? And the case is so clear. There's no way back now. Which means we have to continue moving forward. Command, what are you talking about? The Moscow Defense Command. Have you ever heard of the Invisible Watchers? I have, but they're just an urban legend. Not at all. They are command. Are you sure they care for more than just protecting their asses? You mentioned the Ark. What's that all about? If anything finds their city, you'll figure everything out. Otherwise, there's nothing to talk about. Do you think finding the Ark of yours is going to fix everything? I do not. But if you have a better idea, then go ahead. Yes, I do. We have to find a good place for people from Moscow. Like Artyom always wanted. Giving them all to the enemy? A grand idea. This is a special I... restoration. Wait a moment, what was that? From the Ark Project base. Everyone what? can hear me. Everyone's still loyal to the cops. You know. Listen, Listen everyone. everyone. Rally point. Rally point location is code 1811-79. Area 1-5. Right. I repeat. Where was that to number the rally supposed point. to be? Rally point location is code God. It is somewhere around here. The Yaman Town Mountain. So the route from here should go like this. This is our goal. So, is this what you had in mind? Yes, this is it. The Ark Project is a whole city underground. Enormous stores, machines, the best experts. It is the Commander General's HQ. All of the country's leaders are there. 
They have already started the restoration work. We will tell them that Moscow is alive. It wasn't all for nothing. Everything will change. Everything. Do you get it? A new life is starting for all the survivors of the <laughs> world. <Yeah. laughs> By the way, are there any single women in that place? <laughs> Great reaction. So I think the moment calls for... <clears throat> Bring it out to me. Bring what out, Colonel? Sir. That thing that's been sloshing about in your canteen. <laughs> you think I'm deaf or what? Ah, that. Uh, just a moment. I, I thought my ears were deceiving me. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a short trip to the Uros, so we should make ourselves comfortable, I guess. Let's name this bucket of bolts at the very least, eh? It's about time. Let's go around and be done with you. <laughs> nah, go to hell. <laughs> Even better. <laughs> Come on. How about Aurora? The rolling goddess of dawn and a cruiser of, uh, uh, you know what. <laughs> Not bad. Aurora, yeah. Ah, beautiful name. Sounds okay, but a cruiser of what? Yeah, I'll tell you later. Looks like it's decided. <laughs> Let's drink to the Aurora. I love how they're just gonna let him. <sighs> hey, Artyom, let's take a look at that map. All right, we had a round. That should be enough. Get him back. Full steam ahead. Hi. Full steam ahead. Wow, that's some distance. I wonder how long it will take. What, what, what did I do? What did I do? What did I do? Shit. After all those years in the underground, the air of the surface seemed incredibly fresh. Oopsies. Intoxicating. Mm -hmm. But that was not what had caused the crew's euphoria. Our journey finally got a definite purpose provided by the transmission from a government bunker in the Urals. For 20 years, we thought that neither the government nor military high command had survived. Turns out they're still around. Where were they while we were eating each other alive in the metro? We'll have a lot of questions for them once we reach Yamantau. If we reach it. The ruins of our country are under enemy control, according to Miller. And we'll have to fight through to our goal. A small team against the occupation armies? What are the chances that we'll succeed? That we'll get some answers? Okay. Whoopsies. Did not mean to do that, but uh Loading screen, loading screen, loading, loading, loading screen. Usually should be done loading by now. Oh, come on, game. Beauty. There it goes. Jesus Christ. Nice, I don't have to wear a gas mask anymore. Froze anything off yet, darling? <laughs> Here, let's warm you up a little bit. So, what do you think our chances of getting to Yamantau alive are? It's the only thing on my father's mind. How to earn his forgiveness, get back to Metro and his old life, the life you had always been running from. And to think, I never believed you. And now I'm looking at this fog, thinking it could actually be hiding our new life from us. By the way, we should be approaching the bridge soon. Damn it! A campfire! People! There are people there! Hit the bridge! Fire! 
prepared. Four bogies on a trolley. Are you all right, Artyom? Yeah. They pierced the cylinder! How bad is it? Can we move? No, we're stuck! Oh, shit! Damn fog. Seems we ran through someone's roadblock. Who was it? Any uniforms? None. They were wearing rags. Just some old farts. Old farts, huh? That's just the perimeter guard. They couldn't put anyone there, even women and children. Do you really think we found them, Colonel? Well, we can't be sure. I was expecting to run into them much earlier. The trolley is headed towards the bridge. Some fortifications there. This looks peaceful. A village and a church on the water. We need intel. Here, Artyom. I put a mark on your map. Get there and find out what you can about that bridge. Taking a prisoner would be ideal. Anna, you cover him. Yes, sir. Yeah, I go with Artyom, too. No. Until we figure out our situation, you are not to take a step away from the Aurora. These two Let's go, Artyom. Just fine. Yermak, when can you get the Aurora running again? Yeah, I don't know yet. Artyom, don't forget your backpack. It's a new model. A portable workshop, so to speak. The manual is inside. Cool. It doesn't come with crafting materials, though, so keep an eye out for those. Just be careful out there. Sure thing. I gotta say, that was one flimsy roadblock. And those guys, well, they didn't look like army men at all. Just old men. Be careful out there. Remember, most of the country has been destroyed or occupied. Seriously, this whole place is just open field? Wow, they turned this into an open game? Did I... Maybe they served the enemy, enslaved or something. <laughs> yes. Now that they made this game fucking, like, open world where you can actually adventure, this is kind of awesome. I never knew that it was gonna be this way. I thought it was gonna be another linear path. Right. Yeah, let's see. We got... Eh. Jump, 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 jump. Oh. And there's a... Ah, oh, great. And crafting materials. Hold L1 to open your inventory. Uh. Okay, that's... Whoa! Okay, that's cool. Oh, you're kidding me. I can literally... Okay, this game just got so much better. I can craft all of it. I don't buy anything. I craft everything now. That's kind of cool.
Yeah, that would explain why I haven't seen any, uh... That would explain why I haven't seen any money. That would explain why I wasn't picking up any bullets. They got rid of the whole shop aspect of the game. I now craft everything. Quick save. I need to know is that if I go this way before I go back to the thing I want to search everywhere on the map but we can in here. A lot of crafting materials. Oh, the fungus is, uh... Oh, come on, go through the hole. There's no point in going back up to the roof, because the ladder is just to get to the roof, not to get into here. It just seems like I could have just entered through here. the dock looks like it's the locals preferred method of transportation all right i'll climb up there while you take the boat and load the search i'll call you when i'm settled break a leg That's a new weapon. Okay, so... Ah, no! Uh, we'll go... Uh, R1, we will go this. We'll keep that equipped. We'll keep my stabilizer. And then we will switch out the pistol. Oh, it's a... Okay, so... Um... Let's see. That's 
cool. Found a new gun. Found a new gun. Let's see what's in here real fast. Anything important? Yeah, some chemicals. The dirtier a weapon gets, the more its performance degrades. Any workbench will allow you to fix the dirt problem. Oh, okay. So now weapons degrade. Okay. Alright, uh, let's in the boat. Paddle away. Actually, yeah, we'll probably first try to exit the boat. Alright. Regretta. Cool. We'll do a quick save. And we're going to call it on that. We're done for to this episode. We will be with another episode up later today. I think. Oh. I see a monster. All right. Hey. Bye, guys.